how well do you feel LGBT people are portrayed on film and TV? So with regards to the film industry, I think it's, again, very similar to government situation. Um, you look at the Oscars this year, there's not one mixed race, black or ethnic minority person up for an award. It's all white men and women. So that's an issue to itself, let alone you put gay people on top of that. Um, I think there is some representation, but not a huge amount. And the representation is on a very small scale. So you look at kind of niche programs, you, you know, Netflix just released a series called AJ and the Queen. And that's about like RuPaul the Drag Queen. Um, you've also got, um, they released like, well, things like Riverdale and Sex Education, a lot of this stuff that they've got on Netflix has LGBT characters that are represented quite well in it, but they're not on a huge scale. Um, when you think about the films that Hollywood is releasing, Moonlight was obviously a big one. Call Me By Your Name, Carol in 2015, but they're very few and far between. Um, and even when they do, but having no, having said that, when they do come out, they are represented in quite a, a good way, I think. I think that the directors have done very well to to represent the characters. I just don't think it's happening enough. You know, a lot of the stories are very similar storylines and not perhaps targeting more controversial so topics or, you know, not... Um, I think there's so much out there that you can tell stories about, but they're not necessarily picking those stories to be told, if that makes sense. Um.